can't believe this is gonna be worth the trouble. Look at this place. Nothing but dust and junk. Oh, it's gonna be Wait, worth listen. If lefties right about Get ready. This being where that new juice is coming from. Hell yeah, it's gonna be worth it. How'd you get any of it anyway? Lefty doesn't even like you. Ah, I cashed in some favors with people who Lefty does like. You just saw because you never gotta pay. <sighs> you better be well. And Lefty, you better share it out fair, or it's not your knees that's gonna be sore. <sighs> when you turn up, you're dead. Hey, who's there? Oh, I know you're here. I'll find you. Who's out there? Huh? Only a fucking coward hides. Back time, boogie man. This is my property. Christ. You are trespassing. Ah. Ah. Something out there. Got him. Where do you assholes keep coming from? Flush them out! Tell me we don't need to find something in here, because that may take a while. Getting tired yet? Time is of the enemy. Uh. Kill them quickly. Gifts on the loot. Doing them much good at this point. Edward, how badly are you hurt? I'm not dead yet. But I don't think I can get up. You kept them from using the elevator? Yeah. I... I sent the elevator down to the basement, like you wanted, and shut it down. Good. Shot quite a few of them before they decided to leave me alone in here. That is uh, Haven't seen anybody for quite a while. I think... You okay? Are you sure you can't get I'll up? I'll be all right. You really use your help. Yeah, Jack. I'm pretty damn sure. Well, then don't worry about it. Me and your friend here will have to take care of things ourselves. They've definitely reached the basement. Although I don't understand how they knew how to get past... It doesn't matter now. We'll have to go through the abandoned part of the building. It looks like the Abremelin field is still functioning. Although several of the security doors in the basement have already been breached. We'd better hurry if we want to stop them. They seem determined to reach Lorenzo for some reason. I'm not going any further until you tell me what's going on. I suppose it's time you knew. It's hard to overstate exactly how dangerous the artifact has made Lorenzo. In addition to being homicidally psychotic, he has also gained enhanced strength and unusual resistance to most kinds of physical damage. He also commands a kind of local telekinesis 
which appears to be projected by the artifact itself. Now, we need to get to the basement before these intruders find a way to set Lorenzo free. Follow me. Be careful, Jack. Nice. You too. Fucking easy. <sighs> what was that? We don't have time for this. I don't think we're alone. Way to the death. Yeah, that's one way to get the coolant pumping. What's that? We never used this wing. Nobody's been in here for decades. There's no telling what we'll run into. Hope we can find a way through. The utility elevator is this on the is bottom one floor. One grim Come locale. On. I don't know. Like he ever tells us anything. Those mercs put up a good fight, huh? Yeah. Not exact. <clears throat> right Something up. Look who's back. Ah! Oh, hey. Sure made a mess of this place, didn't they? Lost them. Hey, toss anything you can't haul my way. No sign of them now. You? I don't Put like it. Let's yeah, go eat them, Star. I don't care if you're you already dead. I'm coming sure to see what that was. I so got it. Oh, you you Jesus. Just leave me alone. I'm Disappearing act, huh? No need to hide. 
This is bullshit. Where do you assholes keep coming from? If I find you, I'm putting the fucking you bullet in your dead. head. Please. I don't care if you're already dead. Your funeral. Flash him out! Oh. Ouch. Come on, little girl. Let's do this. Playing games with me, huh? This is our score! Anybody now? Good. The old utility elevator is still working. This will take us to the basement. Come on. Going down. Kill everyone you see. Don't hesitate. We can't let them release Lorenzo. are trying to shut down the Abremelin field. That's the only thing keeping Lorenzo from breaking out of there. We need to get in there and stop them. Hello, Jack. It's been a long time since I've had the pleasure of a personal Looks visit. Like Father, last time I, got a check I will stop this. My powers have grown, Jack. The artifact still has so much to teach me. Once I am free, I will be happy to teach you too. You know I can't let you out until I can remove the artifact. Let me see. Lucifer's balls. They've locked down all the security doors. I'll have to open them one by one from here while you work your way down the hallway. Quickly now! That's right. You need to shut down the containment field in order to open the door. What am I paying you for? You're supposed to know this technical shit. You've almost got it. 
That's right. You need to shut down the containment field in order to open the door. They're almost through! Get that door open! I'll be happy to show you how to get more of the serum. I'm opening as soon the main as door. you let me out Hurry! The adrenaline field is down! Apparently, <laughs> even the simplest task was beyond your capabilities. That's it. I can feel my strength returning. Now, now I will finally be free! Don't listen to my son. He's the crazy one. You know this. Look at what he's done to me. I built a failsafe into the containment grid, switched the four Abremelin generators to manual override, and I can flood his cell with a lethal dose of Zeta radiation. Do the right thing. Open this door and let me out. Do the right thing. Let me out of here. Let him out! Everything my son has told you about me is a self-serving lie. That must be obvious now. Yes! Now set the other three generators and I can end this. Think back on everything Jack has told you. Who do you think is really the crazy one here? everything I could to avoid this. I believe I was close to finding a way to remove the art. Liar! Let them put me here forever if you've had your way, puny worm. <laughs> Do you truly think you have the power to destroy me? <laughs> Good Goodbye, father. We didn't have any other choice, <sighs> did we? What would he have done if he'd gotten free? Oh, he would have killed both of us. And then the rest of my family. And that would only have been the beginning. His crimes, back when he was free. It was only because of my family's influence that he ended up here, rather than on death row. The world now, it's a world made for monsters. Nothing could have stopped him. No. I've answered my own question. We truly had no choice. Looks like I'm out of a job. Yes, without Parsons to maintain, I don't see a need for your services. Before you go, <clears throat> I couldn't have done this without your help. I think this is fair compensation. I won't be needing your services after this. Great. Thanks. One more thing. I've done so much research on the artifact. I may be able to do something with it. Come back and see me at Cabot House in a week or so. All my research may not have been completely in vain. Hey. Take a look. I think we ought to talk. What's wrong? Wrong? Oh no, nothing's wrong. We've just been traveling a while now, and I figure there hasn't exactly been equitable distribution of information. I've gotten a decent glimpse into your dirty laundry, but you still don't really know a whole heck of a lot about me. I figured I'd offer to balance the board. So, anything you want to know? 
What do you remember about the Institute? It's all pretty hazy from back then, but now and then I get glimpses. Life inside the Institute, they keep you isolated. Single test chamber with my whole world for years. And someone was always watching. Then one day you wake up on the other side. And that's it. They've cut you loose. Welcome to the brave new world. Such people in it. What's with the outfit? After I started the agency, it just seemed like the sort of thing a detective ought to wear. I got some old memories, pre-war. Faded to all heck of guys dressed like this, doing what I do. Putting on the hat and trench coat, and I figured it'd let folks know I was serious about the whole thing. Clothes make the man and all that. Guess I felt they made me the man I wanted to be. So, who are you, Nick? That's a question I've been trying to figure out myself for a long damn time. I know I'm a synth, authentic institute handiwork, but I'm still mechanical, not bioengineered like the fancy synths giving everyone the willies these days. I get tune-ups now instead of checkups. My memories, my personality, they're all lifted from some cop who volunteered for an experiment back before the war. They scanned his brain and copied it onto the hardware that runs between my ears. Don't know why they chose to make a robot based on some pre-war cop instead of a math genius or a bioengineer. Hey, maybe that's why the Institute tossed me in the garbage instead of turning me into one of their people snatchers. That's terrible. They really just threw you away? Sure did. It's quite the rude awakening. I remember waking up one day in a garbage heap, a body in tatters and a head full of memories belonging to a man who'd been dead for 200 years. Suffice to say, it was a confusing couple of weeks. Folks didn't really know much about synths back then, so when I finally ran into people, they mostly treated me with caution rather than hostility. But the kids, <laughs> they weren't afraid. I think his name was Jim. The first person to actually speak to me I got the boot from the Institute. My first human contact in this world. Grilled me for an hour. <laughs> Once they'd seen I wasn't gonna hurt anyone, the other folks in the neighborhood came out to ogle the mechanical man. He'd eventually turned into a pretty swell soiree. The local mechanic even gave me a once-over free of charge. Those people, they, they treated me like a human being. I've been trying to return the favor ever since. It's a surprisingly rare trade out here sometimes. It's something I've noticed you got a fondness for. Part of the reason I've stuck around this long. You really think you were anything more than a, a, a sideshow to those people? I don't doubt that's partly true, but they still treated me better than they had any requirement to. I think it's a lesson worth considering. Well, I expect you're about as bored as can be listening to me rattle my skeletons. You should probably head out. If I got it. <laughs> 